Good day to everyone. I'm Mad Wantamad and welcome to another video here at Nayon Kalikasan. We are here at Nayon Kalikasan for us to show you our made four fish tank aquaponics setup with three grow beds on the side. Let us walk through the setup and see how it works. So first, let us look at our four fish tanks. So here we have four fish tanks. This is fish tank number one, which has a water inlet which has a venturi to add air or aeration to our water. It also has in an overflow, which is a 2-inch pipe that overflows to the next fish tank, which is fish tank number 2. Fish tank number 2 is connected in parallel to fish tank number 1. It has the same inlet with a venturi and is connected in parallel to fish tank number three. Fish tank number three has the same parallel inlet connection with Venturi and is connected in parallel to fish tank number four. So fish tank number four has an inlet and an outlet which overflows to our five stage filter on the outside of our setup. So outside our setup we have our five stage filter. To provide aeration for our system we have here our silent type diaphragm air pump which provides aeration to our five stage filter our four fish tanks and our two floating raft systems outside each fish tank contains 100 red tilapias and has a capacity of 1200 liters of water Aeration can be controlled through a small valve which is connected to an air manifold which runs all throughout the system. Now let us go outside to see our three grow beds. So we have two floating raft grow beds, and one gravel bed with a bell siphon. Here we have floating raft number one, which has an inlet from our sump and has seedlings of lettuce growing on net pots. We also have cuttings of tarragon that we want to root. And underneath our floating raft, we have crawfish, but we can't see them right now because they are nocturnal. But we feed them with high protein pellets to provide good nutrition for them. Here is our standpipe, which controls the level of water in our floating raft and where the water exits to our sump. Now let's go to floating raft number 2. It has a water inlet that comes from our sump. It also has lettuce seedlings growing in net pots. And has the same standpipe which exits back to our sump. Now after our two floating raft grow beds, we now go to our third grow bed which is our gravel bed. Our gravel bed is supplied by water by a pump in our sump and has a bell siphon over here which has a temporary stone weight to prevent the bell from floating. Now this bell siphon controls the flooding and draining of our gravel bed. The drain of our bell siphon goes to our sump, which is the fifth stage of our five-stage filter. So here is our five-stage filter. Let us now open the cover to reveal the inside of our filter. So here we have the sump, which contains a pump that supplies the water 
to the four fish tanks and to the three go beds. The outlet of our fish tank goes to the first stage, which is our radial flow filter. As you can see, the flow of the particles inside our radial flow filter is parallel to the radius of our filter, hence the name radial flow filter. If you want to see how a radial flow filter is different from a centrifugal flow filter, thumbs up on this video or subscribe to my channel so we can show you in our future videos. After the radial flow filter, the solids will now go to our brush filter, which is aerated to prevent anaerobic digestion of our solid. The next stage is also the matalamat filter, which is also aerated to provide oxygenation to the next stage, which is our moving bed bioreactor, or MBBR. Movement is provided by a water that is bypassed in our pump. So here we have our sump, which has a pump that provides the water to our push tanks and our blue beds. The mineralized water goes back to our fish tanks and our grow beds and the cycle continues back to our filter. So here we have oregano cuttings and some tomato cuttings that we are trying to root in our gravel bed. And now, it's fish feeding time. So there you have it, our four fish tank aquaponics setup with three grow beds on the side here at Nayon Kalikasan. Thank you for watching. Again, thank you for watching our videos. To learn more about how we make farming easy here at Made Farms, subscribe to my YouTube channel Madoda or add us on Facebook Modular Aquaponics. See you in the next videos. I'm trying to farm here.
Sinentro ko pa kasi Kita yung kumakain sa loob Joke lang